software engineers are some of the highest paid people on the planet so today we are going to take a look at the five highest paying companies for entry level or junior software developer positions now these positions are typically for the people who has no experience working in any of the tech companies they might be fresh graduates or they might have some coding bootcamp experience but their lack of experience is still not stopping these companies from paying them hundreds of thousands of dollars so without any delay let's get started So number five company on the list of highest paying companies for entry level or junior software developer positions is actually LinkedIn. LinkedIn pays a whopping salary of $220,000 for their entry level jobs and they are given the title of software engineer. For those who don't know, LinkedIn is world's biggest social media for working professionals and they are growing in the number of daily active users for the past few years now. Apart from paying pretty good salary for entry level jobs, they also have great benefits and on an average LinkedIn spends about $28,000 for additional benefits for their employees which include things like free lunch, dinner, breakfast, remote work, unlimited vacations and excellent health and wellness benefits. Number 4 on the list of highest paying companies for entry level jobs is Databricks. They pay pretty great salary of $230,000 for their entry level engineers who are given the title of L3 engineer. For those who don't know, Databricks is a unified open analytics platform for building, deploying, sharing and maintaining enterprise grade data, analytics and AI solutions at scale. With the current rise in AI, they are expected to grow at pretty rapid pace and they are doing a lot of interesting stuff right now. So if you can, definitely it would be a good opportunity to join their team. Apart from paying pretty good salary of $230,000, they spend about $14,000 for the additional benefits for their employees, which include things like free lunch, free snacks, unlimited paid time off, great health benefits and 401k match programs. Number 3 on the list of highest paying company is Roblox. They pay a whopping salary of $238,000 for their entry level engineers who are given the title of IC1. Now for those who don't know, Roblox is an app that allows users to play a wide variety of games, create games and chat with others online. It combines gaming, social media and social uh, commerce on their ecosystem and that's why they have been able to generate so much money. Apart from paying great salaries to their entry level engineers, they spend about $12,000 on the benefits as well which contains awesome perks like free lunch, free snacks, unlimited paid time off and various contribution matches. Now for these three companies have been based in the US so far but number two company on the list of highest paying company for the entry level jobs is actually based out of Europe uh, that is called IMC that is based in Amsterdam Netherlands and they pay around $240,000 for their entry level engineers who are given the title of L1 engineer. Now IMC is a proprietary trading firm and market maker in various products listing on exchanges globally from gold and stocks to jet fuel and commodities they trade everything and they are one of the world's first leading market makers trading on more than 80 different exchanges around the world so that's why they are always looking for smart engineers to build better platforms apart from paying around two hundred and forty thousand dollars they also spend about $14,754 on additional benefits for their engineers which include things like free lunch, free dinner, free breakfast, about 20 days of paid time out and uh, good health and wellness benefits. So these are the companies who pays enormously well for entry level jobs. Now before we find the number one company who pays the most to the entry level engineers, I would like to make a couple of honorable mentions. These are the companies who are so close of being on this list but they are not here just because of a couple of other things. So number one honorable mention I would like to make is a company called Played. They pay about $220,000 to their entry level engineers who are then given the title of E3 engineers. Now Played is a payments platform that enables you to securely connect your financial accounts to other different applications and they are suddenly seeing a rise in their product growth so that's why they are hiring more people now and paying very good sums of money. And next honorable mention I would like to make is a company called Figma. Now earlier this year Adobe decided to buy Figma for around 19 billion dollars 
which suddenly boomed the net worth or the valuation of Figma, that, uh, which subsequently made them much more valuable and all of their engineers who had the vested stocks, they all became significantly higher in the value. So if you see the numbers, Figma pay about pay around $240,000 to their entry level engineers, which is definitely a great sum of money. But pretty recently, the deal between Figma and Adobe did not go through and the $20 billion merger failed. So that's why I'm skeptical that maybe if they are going to continue to pay that much sum of money to the upcoming entry level engineers or not. That's why I have put them as an honorable mention. And now drum rolls please the number one company who pays the most to their entry level engineers are jane street they pay a whopping sum of three hundred and twenty five thousand dollars for their entry level jobs that's like one third of a million that's so much money for the entry level engineers or a 21 year old kid who just graduated from a college or university. It's mind blowing to imagine that. Now definitely they are based out of New York which is a very high cost of living area and there are many other different aspects but still this is enormous amount of money for someone with little to no experience and they are given the title of L1 engineer. Now, for those who don't know, Jane Street is a global liquidity provider and trading firm that uses sophisticated quantitative analysis and deep understanding of market mechanics to help keep the prices consistent and reliable. They have great benefits and they spend about $16,500 on the employee benefits as well which include things like 15 day vacation, free food, free drinks, free snacks, unlimited sick days off and excellent health and wellness benefits. Number one, all the data points you saw was taken from a website called levels.fyi for those who don't know definitely go and check out that website it is a great place for all the engineers to contribute their salaries all the data points are genuine and provided by other different engineers working for those companies and uh, that gives you a rough estimate of how can you negotiate your salary if you are applying for that job and they have many other services to provide uh, they have just released the 2023 pay report that contains all the information about different geographies and different job positions uh, for different roles and they have provided the list of highest paying companies few important observations we can make is that none of the fang companies actually made to the list of highest paying companies for the entry level engineers that should give you an idea that how the tech, tech landscape is continuously changing i'm not saying that fang companies are not a great place definitely they pay enormously well for all the levels as well but for the entry level positions there are new companies in the market that you can definitely target now all of the data points and all the currency was actually in us dollars most of the companies are based in us except imc which was a big shocker and they are always looking for fresh talent so even if you don't have much experience working in it companies you can still get great benefits great compensation and that would set you up for success for rest of your life so let me know in the comments what other positions you would like to see the videos for and i can make them and uh, till then take care